Okay, hi uh, guys. <clears throat> yeah, today I'm gonna show it to you how to put the coding yeah, for Twister game. Yeah, as you can see, yeah, uh, for the basic coding, well, it's quite simple, but I'm gonna adding uh, some extra. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna adding some a uh, countdown from that uh, Twister game coding. Yeah, so that means we're gonna modificate some of this uh, tutorial. Yeah, as you can see, I'm gonna try to uh, modificate this one, this countdown, because I'm gonna use the basic uh, coding from this countdown, and I will continue it to our Twister coding. Okay, let us start. First of all, yeah, that you need to do, yeah, definitely you're going to need this one. Yeah, you're going to need this one. This one you didn't need it. Yeah, and also forever you didn't need it. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to modify it using some of the button. Yeah, we just click this next after finish. Yeah, we're going to check it. What will we use? Now, this one on start, yeah. We will not be gonna using it. So what we gonna use? Yeah, what we gonna use is only this one. Yeah, for blah blah blah, index do blah blah blah. Yeah. So that means that's the thing that we gonna do. Yeah. We are gonna drag this one. Yeah. For these things, and then let us check again. Play tune middle uh, middle C for uh, one uh, divided four. Yeah. For this one now for this sound you may change it uh, with any other sound that you prefer yeah for example in here yeah uh, you may choose uh, this one yeah for the beat definitely 100 one uh, divided by four yeah and then for the sound yeah you can hear it using your earphone yeah you may choose which one that you prefer yeah this one is middle C. This is the default one. You may change it with the others if you want to. Yeah, I will try to use middle C. Yeah, and then next, let us check again. In here, they said show number. Yeah, three minus index. Now, last time I already explained it why we need to use three minus index. Yeah, so I don't have to explain it. Again, yeah, we're gonna change this value, yeah. Okay, and then we're gonna try to check. Let us check again. Ah, show number. This one, show number. Okay, this. Now, this one definitely you gonna need this index. Yeah, you are gonna use this index. Okay, I'm gonna try to put it here. And I'm going to try to drag this index. Yeah. Okay, this one. Wait for a moment. Nah, that one index. And for the show number, I will drag this math first. Yeah, I'm going to drag minus something. Yeah, minus something. Yeah, according to this one, minus something. This one three, yeah. This one three, and then this one is index. Yeah, uh, we're gonna go to the variable, we're gonna drag this index. Now it's done, and then next step is we're gonna play tone. Yeah, uh, you can use middle G. Yeah, this one you can drag it. Yeah, you may choose middle G if you want to. Yeah. Uh, that means uh, you can choose that one if you like and for the beat it's one yeah uh, after that after you're done with this you're gonna show a string yeah you're gonna choose a show string or you're gonna choose uh, something else yeah for me I will choose uh, some icon yeah when it's done okay let us click finish now nah. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna set these things, yeah, using input. So that means I'm gonna put this one, yeah. I'm gonna put this one, nah. So we can see it, 
Yeah. Uh, you will see the display in here. See? Now, if I press something, yeah, they will have a sound uh, like the old one, yeah, like the one that stopwatch that we're making. So that means I wanted to see, yeah, after this, yeah, I wanted to see there is a logo. So I will know that this one uh, work correctly. Yeah, I will try to use this heart logo. Yeah, for example, you may check it in here. Okay, I will try to play it. Okay, yeah, that's how it looks like. Okay, yeah, for making these things. Yeah, see? Okay, next step, we're going to start to put the coding for the motor. Yeah, same like uh, a soccer game, we're going to go to the extension. Yeah, and then we're going to choose this one yeah of course we use edubit yeah edubit okay now this is our edubit yeah this is the one that we're gonna use now you choose this one and then go to the motor because we using motor this time yeah you gonna drag this run motor yeah run motor uh this one like uh in Edubit later, we're going to have two motor, motor one and motor two. Later, I'm going to uh, explain it. And for the speed, yeah, uh, you may choose any other value, but make sure do not make it too fast. So uh, make sure you put the value under 100. So the motor is not uh, moving really, really fast. Yeah, I'm going to put this one, 80 maybe. Yeah, And then I'm going to add some weight yeah. in here we're gonna drag this one and then we're gonna add uh since this one is for random yeah they spinning yeah and they gonna choose which number on the board yeah and then which one that they gonna use so that means uh we're gonna use random random you can find it to this mat now this one Pick random, you can drag it in here, yeah, for pick random, yeah, and then you change the value, start from 200 into 1000, so that means the spinning maximum is 1000, yeah, spin, and then 200 for less, yeah, it will be put random, yeah, yeah, see, it's done. Okay, next step is after you wait it, definitely after they spinning, like this, yeah. Uh, when you press button, they spin. Definitely, they need to be paused and it will be stopped. Now, for uh, stopping the motor, here you got uh, this one, brake motor. Yeah, you can put it like this. Now, still using this M1, yeah. And then you can put some kind of sound, yeah, uh, when it stops. So there is a sound something, yeah. For example, I'm going to choose, not radio, I'm going to choose music, this one. Maybe I will try to use, nah, I'm going to try to use this one, change it into uh, badding. Where is the badding? Hi, here this one, the badding things. Now, uh, and then in the end, I will put some uh, logo again. Yeah, so I'm going to put this one. I will show the checklist logo. And then in the end, the screen will be gone. Yeah, we're going to choose clear screen. Now, uh, let us check. This is how it looks like. See? two one spinning and then checklist and then um, the screen will be off yeah that's how you make the coding for this thing it's quite long yeah uh, but overall it's worth it it's quite nice yeah to make sure it's easy for you to memorize it 
later during the project things you can go to the tutorial um, for the countdown and then you may continue it with the twister code yeah it's only as a simple as that i guess that's all from me hopefully you can do it good luck with your project boys girls yeah hopefully everything will be okay and don't forget last thing but not least don't forget to download this one yeah download it and then you may copy paste it yeah don't forget to copy paste it to your micro bit yeah don't forget to copy paste it okay i guess that's all from me thank you yeah have a nice day